Bear. What's up, buddy? How we doing? Is it cold enough out here for you? Yeah? You enjoying the snow? What's up, y'all? Welcome to the channel. As you guys can see, you haven't heard from me since last Saturday. Because, well, it snowed a bunch. Um, it's pretty much been snowing every day a few inches. And this is uh, a little window today for about eight hours where it's not going to snow before it snows. I want to say another foot and a half um, on top of this uh, by Sunday. So and today is Thursday. Uh, thirsty Thursday, Turbo Thursday, whatever you like. So uh, I'm taking the Jeep out, run into the store early this morning before work. And I uh, thought I'd bring you guys along. So enjoy. Ready for a little Turbo Tuesday. Let's do it, people. All right, y'all, so I know everybody's probably a little disappointed that, uh, you know, I haven't done the dyno video yet, and to be frank um, or honest, I am too. Uh, I was expecting to, you know, hopefully do it a little bit sooner, but obviously with Adam uh, moving his shop like we talked about, I mean, that's what's happening right now and has been happening, um, you know, the last week or two, so... With that being said, I did talk to him um, via text message a day or two ago, and he did say he expects to be able to have the, hopefully the Evo done next week in terms of that oil line that we talked about in previous videos. And then he will uh, obviously be able to get the dyno all hooked up, and uh, which I believe he's doing this week and it uh, in the new shop, meaning and getting it all set up and whatnot. But, um, and then we get this thing, meaning the Jeep up there, get the oil change done like I talked about before. And then we can also, get it on the dyno and see what this thing's gonna make so because um, like I said it still hasn't been properly tuned I'm just really on a, a toned down version of my old tune uh, for pump gas and, and break-ins so 
Uh, it's still running good, it hasn't thrown any codes, no engine lights or anything new. Um, like I said, sorry for the lack of content, but with the weather being so shitty, this is literally the only eight hour period that I have to get out and do anything. So it's supposed to start snowing this evening. And uh, like I said, it's supposed to snow, I want to say upwards of a foot and a half from now through uh, Sunday, which sucks. But <laughs> um, I mean, I like snow personally, but I just can't, you know, I'm not going to bring this thing out in it and get it covered in salt and, you know, take the chance of it rusting and shit because I do plan on keeping it for a while. So, um, hope everyone's having a good day on this Thursday. Looking forward to the weekend. Um, I did want to remind you guys of a couple things that I have coming up. Um, in terms of racing events uh, with getting the Evo back. Like I said, I do have those two events in April uh, with GPS Track Time, so check out their website. Uh, GPS Track Time out of the Chicago area. And I will be doing the Joliet Autobahn. I think it's on Sunday, April 8th. Um, I'll put it down in the description of this video for you guys. But And then uh, a few weeks later, at the end of April, I'll be doing uh, a two-day event, Saturday and Sunday, at Gingerman Raceway. Uh, once again with the Evo, this will be road racing. And once Adam gets this thing all tuned up, uh, usually the drag strip opens traditionally. Um, usually, I mean, it depends on weather, but usually it opens at least end of, end of March, beginning of April. Um, so I expect to be able to get this thing out there, um, obviously, and see what we can do with regards to quarter mile time uh, with the built engines. So still going to be on the stock transmission, which, you know, will be a limiting factor for now. But like I said, this summer... Um, if enough of you guys subscribe to the videos and, and, and help me, you know, make this channel huge, then uh, we can do it sooner. But uh, if I have to pay out of my own pocket, it'll probably have to wait till this summer. Um, but yeah, uh, outside of that, um, I'm going to drop another video for you guys Saturday. I'll, I'll let you guys uh, see how much snow that we have. And uh, maybe I'll take this thing off-roading, wink, wink, uh, in, in my driveway again. <laughs> Hope you guys liked that. But... Um, outside of that, that's about it, guys. I really don't have much to update you on. Like I said, I haven't been able to drive this thing much, but I am hoping to get up to Adams uh, next week and, um, like I said, get the Evo back, start making some Evo content for the Evo fans out there, and then uh, get this thing on the dyno and make the dyno video, which is going to be epic. So I'll make sure I do a good job on that. So um, once again, I appreciate everyone that subscribed this subscribe, excuse me, thus far. And uh, I know the channel's really growing the last couple weeks, and I really do appreciate it, and that's why I'm making more videos. Um, but like I said, help me get to 1,000, and, and after that, we'll just keep getting bigger. And uh, like I said, making more cool content, and uh, just crushing it pretty much is, is what I'm all about. So we'll go for the world record, hopefully, in this thing and the, as far as the 8-speed, and uh, start setting some uh, real fast times in the Evo on the road courses this summer. So looking forward to that as well. So... Once again, appreciate y'all, and you guys have a great day, and we'll check back in.